Any philosopher stones lying around? <laughs> Alchemist. Hey, what are you doing in my laboratory? <laughs> Look, it's a plumber. A very familiar looking plumber. <laughs>some more knots of pen and paper before we get too far into this i want to thank you i really do appreciate your support and i appreciate when you boom on that like button boom it <laughs> this is your first time here go ahead and subscribe for daily videos all right so i believe where we picked off left off we did some crafting and we finished the, the quest for the sewer so now we have a little side quest so we're going this is level 12 and this is level 10 Huh, maybe we ought to, uh, yeah, let's, let's try it. Uh, let's try it, guys. Let's try it. Uh, the town janitor says, hello, Brave Adventures, up for a little task? He really looks like the guy from, uh, Mythbusters. That's who he reminds me of. You're a janitor now. If the task is about cleaning up the sewers with sores and chemicals, then we're ready. Hmm, not really what I was thinking of, but you can do that too. Last night, the tavern keeper told me about a shortcut to the sewers. Quite handy, time to do some cleaning. The party is being attacked. Look, it's a pretty little slime. Let's just attack it normal since it's just one. I know this is going to get ugly because this is a level 12 fight. Doesn't make sense that... Let's see if we can stun him. There we go. And then we'll just attack it normal. Attack normal. We gotta save that mana, y'all. And then we'll see if we can stun him again. And just like that, boom, he's dead! Victory! I hope you guys have victory over the day. Everybody needs a little victory. There's a yellow slime. That's kind of grody. Uh, the yellow one's a little tough, so let's let's slap it with a little mana, a little magic, and uh, let's do this. Boom! Now we just got this green boy down here. Let's uh, let's do this because we can. Oh, oh, he bit somebody. That's just rude. Uh, we'll attack with that, and we'll do that. Why do I have to select them? I don't understand. And then we'll heal ourselves. And now everybody should get a little mana from that. Yeah. And then we'll attack with that. And with that. And we'll try to stun him again. Boom. Oh, he's stunned. Look here. The little mage. The, the, the little cleric finished him off. Boom. Enemy quality. Enemy diversity. We got some extra gold. That's awesome. Oh, we're being attacked again. Oh, 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 oh. Let, let's do this. Oh, this this is getting scary now. Uh, let's do this. Oh. Oh, yeah, a little rip post action. Let's get rid of this guy. I know I should have used that on the back row, but the yellow guy is tougher than the green guys, and I'm really worried about him just wreaking havoc on us. So our little dude's having trouble. We really need to heal him. 39, that's a pretty good heal. Oh, get off my rogue! Oh, that don't help. Oh, we ain't got enough to cleave. I'll we'll just do that one. And then, can you do it? Can you do it? Oh, yes. Shoo. Extra XP. Look, we got some lettuce. I know you guys are excited about lettuce. All right, let's level these guys up. I love this skill. All right, so now we go to here. Poor old uh, Surfer Dwarf Warrior here. He didn't level up, so. What's this do? Damage five, threat five, wound five. Damage five, threat. I really like the stun better than the, the threat. Can you work? Can you use that? No, it's, is it two-handed? Can you? 
Oh, that's awesome. I bet he sucks at it, though. Uh, should we get this? I think we need... Our heels are doing okay now, so let, let, let's get our extra energy up. And then... If, well, I thought we had three level ups. I guess not. Just two? That's disappointing. Alright. Let's, uh... What's this say? I think I'll call it Day the Town is surely a more peaceful place now. That was an interesting quest. Good job, anyway. Meanwhile, I discovered that the signs are affected by the excessive XP potion leakage. <laughs> That's why they're so big nowadays. Yet another problem caused by the paper knots. Looky there. Ah, oh, that's what we needed. A little, little love for a little dude here. Let's see. I'm using that stun more and more. What's this, power lines? Attack any target with 108% damage and gain one threat until the end of battle. Can you tar can target back row? Attack a row of enemies with... Let's get the cleave back up a little more. Yeah, we'll take that. All right. Let's close this. Let's uh, let's let's grab an in. That was a pretty tough quest. It was level twelve. There we go. Everybody's all rested up. All right. So let's check this. Let's get on it. Robin Hood. <laughs> hey, hello, adventurers. I hear you want to speak with me. Yes, we need the password for the gates of the Great Wall. Robin Hood, you have proven to be worthy, so I'm happy to help you. Do a favor and get it, get a favor. That's the Thieves Guild way. Finally, please share the password with us so we can continue our journey. I don't have the current password, but I do know where you can find it. Travel to the Tower of Brass and you will find the password engraved on the laboratory table. All I ask is that you leave the back door open when you leave. Travel to the Tower of Brass and locate the password. We might as well... Tower Brass. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah. Well, what kind of monsters we got here? So we got a mushroom gnome, a boosted bandit, a giant beetle. Oh, let's add two of these. Let's add two of these. And, oh, we can't add that. All right, so let's take this out and add that. No. Wow, really? You take that? No, not that. Ooh. Let's see, take one of those. I want to add a band, one of these. Okay, now we can add all three. Oh, this is going to be fun, guys. It's going to be fun. Oh, what's that? Where's greenery? Health restoration is 25% more efficient. Well, isn't that nice? Boom, boom, boom. Uh, let's do this on this guy. Oh, it's super effective. That's awesome. Hey, don't hit him. That's rude. Boom. Let's give him a little love. There we go. Let's attack. And let's attack. Ow! Attack. We'll heal him. Boom. I am just loving this game. This game is so much fun. The only thing that, that could make this game any better is actually the ability to add multiplayer. Like, I'd love to be able to play this with Harmony, uh, maybe Grey still plays, or even Thane. This is awesome. This is awesome. All right. So, we seem to be okay. Oh, we need to search. We need five. Oh, oh, we got one. Four more to go. Oh, we got one. Three more to go. Oh, one. And we got one. Two more to go. Wow. I'm rolling terrible today. Look at that. Oh, that makes up for it. Dumpster diving. You found a batch of second-rate magic mushrooms. If these are to be thrown away, it can't really hurt anyone to take a couple with you. Well, what are, 
I don't understand. What, what are those? What do they do? Oh, you gain 500 XP. <clears throat> hmm. Uh, let's give them to... Let's give them to this guy. H how we use it? Like that? Yes. Yes. Boom. There we go. Maybe he'll start catching up. All right. So now we need to do our quest. You arrive at a lush and peaceful garden. The sun is shining and surprisingly the faint smell of XP is lingering in the air. What a nice spot for a picnic. As you are dreaming of picnic baskets and lazy afternoons, you are interrupted by angry guardians. The mushroom gnomes attack. Bring it on. Let's attack. This one. Let's attack this one. Let's attack this one. That's what I'm talking about. You're out of here. What are you going to do? Oh, you gave me a kiss or something. That was weird. So weird. Boom. And that's the end of that. Got some bonus gold. All right. Now what? Mushroom gnomes. There's definitely something strange going on here. The gnomes smell very strongly of XP. A jar of XP mushroom fertilizer falls from the pocket of one of the gnomes. So that's why Robin Hood wanted to gain access to the area's secret XP mushroom plantations. Near the tower base, you see an open door that leads to the underground caves where the mushrooms are grown. That's where the gnomes came from. And next to the caves are the great stairs leading to the front door of the tower. Green fumes float around the third floor windows. That's where the laboratory will be. Why don't we visit the XP plantation first? You want to meet gnomes that want to eat those shrooms for breakfast, lunch, and dinner like level 400 gnomes? Your hesitation took too much time. Your party is being attacked. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Let's be attacked. Who's next? Two, three. You give me a pretty little kiss. What, what does that mean? Oh, he's confused. That is no good. No good at all. I wonder how we fix that. Remember these two. Oh, they're not very, they're not very, uh, magic weak. Alright, let's do, let's do this. It'll, it'll heal everybody a little bit. And it give everybody some mana. Let's do this again. Alright, we got rid of the weird mushroom dudes. Pro tip, someone might need some healing. <laughs> no, he's good, he's good. See? I told you, he's good. Oh, we got a carrot. Everybody likes carrots. Not really. I do like carrots, though. Alright, let's level her up. Get that chain lightning up. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Alright, we need to, uh, we need to sleep. I hope we roll, okay? There's two. Oh, at least one person got it. I think that's all it takes is one person. We need to save up enough money to get us another player. I wonder if we can do that now. What? Oh, 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 oh. Where is it at? Ninja. What's your main stats? Agility or the green one? All right. And Elf is the best one, and that gives you two. I'll make you. <laughs> oh wow, wow! All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's let's do, let's just do this. Actually, let's get rid of this dude and uh, add these dudes. Oh, wow. That just made me laugh. We got a cheerleader ninja. Oh, we need to give him a weapon, don't we? And we can't do that right now. <laughs> Here, you attack that dude for two. What do you think a ninja's primary weapon is? Oh, these guys are a little tough. Start paying attention or I'm gonna go splat. Let's take these guys out. Uh, 
Uh, this will be a little easier to manage. A little level one ninja. If he gets hit, he's out of here. All right. Oh, uh, come on. One more hit. Boom. Let's see how many levels he gets. One, two, two and a half. All right, so what we got here? We got the black arts. It's wound. So you get wound one to all your critical hits, which are very rare. Vanish. Uh, you lose threat, and you get a critical bonus until you take damage. Automatically activates. Uh, Shadow Chain, attack any target three times with 44% damage. Can target the back row. And Smoke Bomb, deal two damage. Your target and adjacent enemies are inflicted with stun. Let's go with this Shadow Chain. I like it. One. Two. Alright, can you, can you use this, dude? So which one's the best? Uh, damage two, damage one. Can you use that? What's that, a staff? I ain't giving you no staff. Hey, let, let's, uh, let's do this. Let's take his away. And give him a staff. What are you doing? I give him the staff. Alright. And then, ninja dude. Can you, can you use this ninja dude? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's a crafting ingredient. I think that's it. Let's give him a little health. I think it's all, oh, we can give him that too. That'll, that'll help him. And can we keep that somewhere? No? Okay. All right. How you like that, guys? Boom. All right. Let's go on with it. When searching the valuables from the gnomes, you happen to glimpse the, their character sheet. You realize that these lawful good creatures have been enslaved by a strong second edition magic. Paper Knight. What has he done? And what's the skill? Mass production 2. Why would he want to create tons of XP potions? We must hurry and stop the Paper Knight. You easily get to the third floor and find a fully equipped laboratory. Shelves are filled with alchemy books and scrolls. Any philosopher's stones lying around? <laughs> Alchemist, hey, what are you doing in my laboratory? <laughs> Look, it's a plumber. A very familiar looking plumber. Oh my goodness. No reason to get agitated. We're just here to find out the password. Password? Password? What is this? You're surely here to steal my research and change one metal into, uh, on changing one metal into another. Like transforming lead to gold? No, no, no. The other way around. I'll change everyone's gold into lead, and then my gold pieces will be priceless. Sounds like a plan that cannot fail. Oh, wow. That is too funny. Too funny. All right, let's get these guys. Boom. Let's see. Let's, let's take out the hero here. <laughs> That's terrible damage. We really need to get him leveled up. And let's do a little bit of this. Give everybody a little love. Oh, he kissed me. Alright, so let's do this to this guy. Let's do this. Maybe that'll get rid of the mushroom. There we go. Then we can do this. Aren't you scared? <laughs> Oh, wow. Let's do this again. And we'll do this again. Boom! Right in the face! <laughs> oh, we got a ring of senses. That's cool. We'll put that on the ninja. Speaking of which. Alright, let's put that right there. Alright, now we need to level up. Let's uh put into that some more. It needs it needs the love. All right, so then we go back over here and give him some love. Boom. Okay. Now, is, nothing, is there anything else we can find here? This is all that's here. Are these stupid gnomes? Okay. You see the password engraved on the side of the laboratory table. Even Adam forever? No, that other engraving. I accept the risk. 
We have the password, so off to the wall. <laughs> Yay! Yay for ninja levels. Boom. Alright. What are we doing out here? Do we have a side quest here? It looks like we do. Let's do the side quest. I think we should get a closer look at these XP plantations. Something strange is going on down there. Yes, we might find another clue to the paper knife's plants. Carefully, we descend to the plantations. Very well. As you go down the stairs, the daylight fades, and finally, you're surrounded by complete darkness. The XP mushrooms demand absolute darkness while growing. Otherwise, they, they just turn into an average substitute for truffles. Fair enough. I already started to think that you haven't made any graphics for this place. While you're trying to navigate around the cave in total darkness, you bump into something angry and know me with a large spotted hat. The mushroom gnome screams out, alerting the guards. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Oh. 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 Oh, 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 oh. Let's go with this guy. How do you like that? I'm gonna have to use my item and everything. This is not good. This is not good. Oh no! Come on, come on, come on. Good grief, that was ugly. I got another ring of senses though. <laughs> Yay! Yes. Yes. Let's give him this ring of senses. Instead of the health. There we go. Alright, so you need to eat. Yes. Yes. And then you need to eat. Yes. Yes. Didn't know you could double click that. There we go. Alright. Let's have, let's have a little sleep, Tap. Yay! At least one of us got the roll rock. That's enough of the visit. We head back to the service. Well, there you go. We got three magic mushrooms. Yay! Oh, we know what we're putting in here. We ain't, we ain't gonna ask. Alright, guys. Let's see. To the wall. Should we leave the back door open for Robin Hood? That'd grant him access to XP mushroom plantations. That would mean more power for the Thieves Guild, but they would be more grateful to us and help us further. Yeah, leave the door open. We put a piece of duct tape on the lock so the dead boat and the latch stay inside of the lock. That should do the trick. You tape up the lock and it seems to work perfectly. The door doesn't lock up. Yay! I'm all about helping the Thieves Guild, guys. And look at that. Our little ninja got another level. Let's give him some of that. Sweet, sweet love. And our warrior did too. So we need to, uh... We need to give him a little bit of that. Oh, yeah. Alright, guys. We're gonna call it right there. This has been the Fat Rogue Saturn X and playing some Knights of Pen and Paper 2. I want you to enjoy your day, enjoy your life, and keep on gaming, y'all. I'll see you in the next vid.